On a sunny afternoon in Lagos, Nigeria, kayak business owner Diana Williams is marketing her services to customers on the shores of the Atlantic Ocean. Here, the Lagos Lagoon provides opportunities for people who want to get a different view of the city while kayaking. Despite its proximity to the ocean, water sports and activities such as kayaking, canoeing or surfing remain rare in Lagos. This is like the craziest experience I've ever had in my entire life. You know, at some point I was feeling like, what if a big fish, like a shark, just comes out and just swallows me? <laughs> what was the way? Like, you know, the tides were just going, the waves and everything. At some point I just had to stop. At some point I was even um, hitting my, my partner's um, boat and it was really scary because I'm wondering like what if both of us just get drowned here you know but it was really fun it was really fun my first time I feel like I didn't do bad you know it's just to listen to instructions and probably know what to do um, you know many people stand a very high risk of actually falling in but I think if you should just listen to what you're supposed to do I think everything will be fine Nigerian sprawling city of Lagos mostly sits on a coastal plain Dan says she has been living in Nigeria for 35 years. Most have never kayaked before. So as you can see, some of the kayakers today, most of them never did. One man was a little scared on his own, but he, I took him out with me. I let him do the paddling once we got out there, and he was quite happy. Diane says she plans to expand her business and add more kayaks to the seven that she currently has. She is also working to reach more people with her services through social media.